Egyptian makeup. We're going to teach you everything you need to know. Put a headband to keep hair back. Put some concealer under your eyes to brighten them and to get rid of those dark circles. Place concealer on, on any blemishes or red areas. If needed, use a concealer brush. Using a concealer brush, put concealer above the eyebrows. It brings out your bright features. Rub in the concealer so that you don't have any spots all over your face. And then place concealer on the crease of your eyes. Rub in the concealer. This helps the eyeshadow stay on better. Using Arbonne eyeshadows and cream, take your concealer brush, take the blue eye cream and make a petal-like pattern. That's nice. Make the petals smoother. Under the blue eye cream, add a green eye cream to make a multicolored flower. Take a purple eye cream and place under the green eye cream like an eyeliner. To make petals smooth, rub them with your finger. using black MAC eyeliner line your eyes very nice get those under eyelids Now you're going to use shimmering eyeshadow to place under your eye to brighten it and pop out the color. Use clear lip gloss because you already have enough colors all over your face. Then close your lips to help apply the lip gloss better. Now here's our hair portion of the Egyptian. Okay, so what you're going to do first is you're going to brush the hair back and pull it into a ponytail. And then what you're going to use using two ponytails, once you get it into a headband, I mean a rubber band, sorry, you're going to make a bun and then use the other rubber band to tighten the bun to make it kind of a messy, cute look. As you see here, she is making the bun and she takes the second rubber band to make it even tighter so you can last through all of those wonderful nights once you have placed the hair where you want it to what you'll do is you'll brush down some of the bangs to get in your face don't brush that out too much but you will only do a little bit and you'll pull it back and then what you'll do is you will get a headband, you'll pull the bangs back again and pull the headband up to try and make a little bump look. You pull down the little wispies at the top at, by your ears, make sure the poof is good.